Is everybody ready to go? Yes! Okay. Welcome everybody to the Piccolo Alberta Junior Jamboree. It's our first one we've ever had. We're super excited to be doing this. But uh, first, a few things who I'd, who I'd like to recognize is the land that we're gathering on here is from Treaty 6 and Treaty 7, and Métis Region 4, home and gathering place of many Indigenous people. I'd also like to recognize Red Deer here as the most active participating community in Canada. Yeah! And also, Red Deer Pickleball Club was the 2021 Club of the Year in Alberta. So, I'd like to recognize a few of our board members that are here from Pickleball, Alberta. Sarah McNeil, where are you, Sarah? Right over here, playing Sarah. Right our secretary. We've got our vice president, Hado O'Thul. Myself, I'm the president of Pickleball, Alberta. But I definitely want to make sure the person we recognize the most today is our junior director who's put so much work and so much time in for juniors this year, our own Brenda Fazer. So we got a lot of exciting things happening today. We're going to be doing some coaching, we're going to do some demonstrations, we're going to do some barbecues, we've got some skills, we've got some giveaways. One thing I want to say is Big Ball Bird is proud to recognize Poach Big Ball, who as of just this past month became a proud sponsor of Pickleball Alberta. So big hand, Brett. Come on in here too, Brett. Brett Forsyth, the president and owner of Pickleball Alberta. And what he has done. I'll own Pickleball Alberta if you want me to. Non-profit. Yeah, Pickleball Alberta. You wish, Brett. <laughs> But Pickleball Alberta and Poach have also put together a special paddle. The Poach Crossfire Paddle. It's got the Pickleball Alberta logo on the bottom of it. And what we're doing is we've worked out an incredible deal or offer from Poach who gave us a special price. And Pickleball Alberta is also going to subsidize it. This is what, an over $100 paddle? Normally, Brent? Yeah, after your well, depends if you're living in Hang on, hang on. <laughs> so normally, this paddle's 90 plus the tax. Um, and even that, like comparable, it's, if you look at like uh, SLKs or anything, like they're 130, 140 bucks. This has a ton of grit. Like, you guys can just feel it. Um, a lot of grit. Uh, it's nice, it's 13 millimeters thick, which is great for the big tent. Uh, so it's not too thick. Um, the fact that Pickleball Alberta is subsidizing it, so it's thirty dollars, and that's taxed in. Is you're not. And I'll say it, Brett. We won't we'll find a better paddle at it. So, anybody that wants to buy it, Brett, they're available over at your table there. All right. Again, thirty dollars tax all in. And it's, very, it's got the grid. It's got a nice, beautiful handle. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to have a little demonstration here. So if I can get Brett. Uh, how do I guess she'll be okay? <laughs> and if I can get Sarah. <laughs> nope, well, Kim's sitting there standing ready to go. Go, Kim, come on in. You are now. <laughs> All right, who knows where pickleball was in first started? Was it in Canada? Was it in Spain? It was in? Seattle, Coast, yeah. Bainbridge Island in Washington State, which is just below Vancouver. And it was in 1965. Now, I'll just give you a relative what that is. I was five years old. It's <laughs> a long time ago. <laughs> so, and what it was was there's some kids that were bored because everybody would go there for summer holidays. And they kept saying to their parents, I, don't, I know you kids never do this, right, Casey and Tina? You never said, Dad, I'm bored, right? So they said, well, you know what, we'll go vent a game. So they, they had an old badminton court. So this is the same size as a badminton court. They lowered it, the net from the badminton down to this height. There was a wiffle ball. Who's got a wiffle ball there? So Brett's got one there. It's got holes in it. 
So it doesn't travel very far and fast, not like a tennis ball. And then they cut out three eighths inch plywood into the shape of a paddle. And then they went out playing, and they keep playing, and they kept playing, and they said, this is a pretty cool idea. So they made rules. And now we're gonna show you a little demonstration here of how the game has evolved. We've got Tim Layton here from Calgary, a national champion. We've got Brett Forsythe from Kamloops. Thank you very much, Brett, for coming all the way. A top owner in pickleball. We've got Sarah McNeil, a provincial champion. We've got Hat O'Toole, a silver medalist. <laughs> so what they're going to do is they're going to play a little bit of a rally here and trying to keep it just friendly here first, right guys? All right, so Sarah's first, and what do you say, Sarah, when you start the rally? What's the, how do you say the score? Zero, zero, two. And what's the first zero mean? Uh, that's my score. What's the second zero mean? Their score. And what's the two mean? Uh, I'm the one and only, but second server. Right, so you get two servers, so it's a zero, zero, and she, because it's the first server of the game, it's zero, zero, two. So Hatto's here, Kim's gonna be returning serve. All right, call the score and we're on. Zero, zero, two. So she serves it diagonally, Kim serves it back deep if she can. Hatto, so now see they're standing at the line here. Now Brett and Sarah are trying to get to the line because you wanna own that kitchen line here. So on this one here, it's here. So now they're doing a dinking rally. Actually doing pretty good. Oh, okay, never seen Sarah make a mistake. That's the first one. Okay, so now, what's the score? Zero, zero, one. And what does the one mean? I am the first server. She's the first server. And you're serving to Sarah, diagonally into that box. So, zero, zero, one, she serves it. Sarah has a nice deep return. They come right to the net. Good volley by, see how Hatto took that one out of the air? That was good, Hatto. <laughs> so, you can take it out of the air in the blue here, but you, you can't be standing in the court and take it out of the air when you're in the green. Okay, you're gonna come this is called the, the kitchen, or the no volley zone, but it's called the kitchen. Yeah. Is that a, a kitchen? You guys, you, you, you get that? What's your name? Wilson. Where are you from, Wilson? Spruce Grove. Spruce Grove, love it, Parkland. Parkland oh. Pickleheads? Yeah. Awesome. Okay, zero, zero, 2 here comes Haddle. No scores yet. Serves it diagonally, trap returns. Ah. Bit of a drive back, nice little back spin there. Oh. Good defense. A oh, little bit of a push. Now we're going. Okay. You guys want her to play a real rally now and see how fast and hard they go? Okay. Here we go. Game one now. Sorry to serve to Kim. 0 0 2. Uh, 0 0 1. First serve. We'll take it. <laughs> 0 0 2. Whoa, okay, that's a good finish. See how we got a little bit of a pop-up there for Hattel? And he put it straight down. That's tough to defend, so zero, zero, one. Nice little top spin with a spin there in her hands. Oh, good. How are they doing so far? Do you think they're doing a good we'll, job? We'll get a rally going. Okay, here we go, zero, zero, two. Nice. Brett, good communication to his partner there. Nice. See how Hato didn't step in the green when he hit that in the air? Good. That's, oh, good cross court there. Very nice. All right, zero. So who knows, what, what does the game go up to? Do you know what the score will normally go, what the game goes to? And you have to win by. Right, so we might be here all day at zero. We got one zero. One zero two. Good. Nice Hato. So they're trying to build the point here, see if we can get a pop-up, make a little mistake. Oh yeah, it's good, it's good. Good defense by Brett. Oh, there it goes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, we'll see one more point. 2-2. 2-0-2. 
Good communication by Kim to say, Paddle, that's yours. Good. Nice volley. Another nice volley. Oh! oh All right, good job there, everybody. All right, let's give him a hat. Everything's pretty good. Popped up on purpose, didn't you? Okay, so what we want to do here before we all get started in, in our own ways is we want to get a picture of everybody to kind of capture the first ever junior pickleball jamboree. So if I get everybody inside the court here, because the sun's there, I'm going to get the juniors, then the coaches and the players, and then the volunteers as well. So everybody come in. So we're gonna, like all the juniors are going to be facing towards the sun. Come on in, come on, yeah, come on in here, everybody. So everybody go right across there. Good. Awesome. Hey, who let you in here with that hat on? I like that hat. Huh? Nobody, I guess. Where's security? Who's your favorite player? What do you mean?